We're out on the edge of the parking lot, south side of Lucas Oil Stadium. Vehicles trying to get in here, uh, a lot of them being denied because this is where the buses and the trucks go to unload. As I was walking over here, I started doing a little math in my head, which is a dangerous thing. Uh, I figure with four buses per band, we have over 90 bands here, at least one semi-trailer. We're talking at least five to 600 vehicles that have to get in and out of this parking lot. It's kind of the great untold story of Grand Nationals. And these three gentlemen are in charge of making sure that it happens seamlessly. Introduce yourselves, please. Robin Rudell, Doyle Wilson. And Stu Holzer. What are the peak hours? When are you busiest? Well, this morning it was started about 6 o'clock, and we were swamped until 8. And then everybody's trying to get in early, get an early start on things. You guys have to have a lot of patience and a lot of uh, orange cones, I would imagine, to cope when, with some uh, stressed out band directors and bus drivers, yeah? For sure. Some of them, they run a little bit late and they just, they go bonkers. They freak out a little bit, Stu? Yeah, they do. I mean, and everybody tries to get in because I'm with the band. and It wouldn't happen without these guys out here. They're the first contact that uh, many of these bands have as they're coming in for Grand Nationals, and they tend to have a soothing effect on the band directors and bus drivers. Get them in and get them onto the field for their performance.